Hello, Inspirational Air here. Um, it's going to be a very different video from what I normally do. Obviously, it's not going to be a stream because I'm not streaming anything. And it is going to be a blog, but it's going to be a very um, personal blog. Um, but I thought it was a personal blog I should share with you guys so I can get more support when I do do it and hopefully raise more money. Um, so, obviously, you know... If you've watched my channel for the last, I think I've been on YouTube now for the last three and a half years, you would have known I don't really share personal stuff on my channel. Right, with the, for example, uh, the personal thing I was dealing with a couple of weeks ago, I haven't gone in detail about that. Um, I do that for two reasons, mainly, um, and this will be a long video, so keep with me if you can. Um, Two reasons I don't go into personal reasons, uh, personal stuff is one, it's private stuff, not just only to me, but the people involved, um, sometimes people are just personal to me, and it's something I don't feel like I have to share, um, and two, I'm not a big YouTuber, if I, you know, some big YouTubers, like, if you're at the millions, which I'm not, I'm far from it, which I was, because I love doing YouTube, but, you know, I'm not at that stage where I have to share personal stuff. Like, I feel like some big YouTubers, um, like the ones that are on 8, 9, 10 million, feel like they have to share their personal life. And maybe if I ever get big on YouTube, which I doubt it, but if I do, I'm happy days. Because um, I'm not going to give up anyway. I'll still do it even if I'm a small YouTuber my whole life. Um, maybe, you know, if I got to that stage, then I would feel like I'd have to share certain stuff. But at the moment, I'm not at a stage where I have to, and I don't feel like I should do. Um, the only time I will share personal stuff is when it is on a necessary basis, which so far hasn't been. Um, or you know, it, you'll find, or if someone's died in my family, you'll know they've died because I normally do a rap. Like I did a rap for my stepdad, I did a rap for my nan, I did a rap for my granddad. Um, you know, but I do. That's just my style of rapping. I do raps on personal matters that mean a lot to me. And obviously my stepdad meant a lot to me. My granddad meant a lot to me. And my nan meant a lot to me. And obviously, you know, I've done other personal subjects like um, depression. Because I have suffered from that. You know, and I use my raps to try and help people. But anyway, that's going on subject, so. You know, but this is a very, very personal and real video to me that's going to be. Um. So, first of all, I'm going to say by saying Happy Father's Day, which is what this video is subject about. Um, as I just said, I have no dad, stepdad, and I don't know where my dad is, what he's doing. He hasn't bothered me since I was 16, 12, I think, something like that. So, my stepdad meant a lot to me. Um, always has, always will. I'm going to have a drink from later. Um, so, basically, this, what this video is going to be about is... I am doing a marathon, a 26k marathon in Cornwall. I think it's the Eden Product, the Eden Product Marathon. Um, I'm doing it for two reasons, like I said. One, because I've always wanted to do something personal like that. To me, that's a very big goal of mine to do a marathon. And if I could ever do one, I could. I'm going to pay for the, obviously, the, you've got to pay to do it. So I'm going to pay for the, not in touch, in the process fee or whatever it is to get on to the, you know, do it. Um, so it's always been a personal goal of mine to do a marathon. Um, and second of all, which is where this gets personal now, I'm doing it for my stepdad, God bless his soul, because he died of cancer about two and a half years ago now, maybe three. Not remember off by heart, but it's somewhere along the two and a half years, three years. Obviously, I miss him every day. Wish he was here every day. Um, you know, so sorry if I get a bit of moosh, because it is a very personal subject. You know, when me and him first met, obviously, as most stepdads do and tried children, we didn't get on, but over time I grew to respect him, I grew to love him as my own dad, because he was the closest thing I had to a dad, and just, you know, learned the ways, he taught me the ways of life, which I'm now trying to pass on to my little brother, because obviously he don't have a dad now. Um, so, yeah, I will be doing this marathon in the name of him and cancer research because he died of cancer and for him. Obviously, you know, every child's had that moment in their life, whether it was 
as an adult or as a teenager, I think mine came when I was about 20 years old, when your stepdad or dad say to you they're proud of you. Now, obviously, mine was, I think, when I had this channel up and running for about a year and a half, he took mine and said he was proud of me. I'm guessing it's because of the channel and I was married. Um, but, you know, or oh, I was had a girlfriend, I can't remember. But, you know, it's... um. So that's why it's personal to me because I'm doing it in someone in the name of someone that meant a very lot to me. So obviously, you know, I thought I'd drop this video on Father's Day because it's Father's Day today. So a happy Father's Day to anyone out there. And if you don't have a father, then I feel for you. Which also brings me on to my second point of this is don't take anyone for granted, whether that be your stepdad, your dad, your mum, nan, anyone, even your friends. I don't have loads of friends, so I'm lucky in that way. I only have about three friends I consider good friends. That would hurt me if I lost them as friends. Um, obviously, I don't have much family left, but I don't take them for granted. And that's the thing I think kids nowadays especially, and don't get me wrong, I love my little brother to bits. <coughs> love, my little, love my little brother to bits, obviously. But as any kid does, they take their mum for granted. And my little brother... By God, does he take his mum for granted. And I try and teach him every day not to. Obviously, you know, he's not going to listen to me all the time. But I try and teach him not to do, you know, take your mum for granted. She could be gone one day, like your dad is. Maybe harsh, but I was just trying to get into him and set him in reality. Like, he needs to listen to your mum, you know, don't take her for granted. And that's the message I want to say as well in this video. Is don't take anyone for granted. Whether, like I said, it's your friends, your family, you know whatever, girlfriend, wife, whatever it is, whoever they are, if they're important to you, don't take them for granted, because one day, they could be gone, you know, I haven't got an aunt, I haven't got a granddad, and I haven't got my stepdad, and I'm not doing this video to get sympathy, so, I'm going to shut that down right now, I'm not doing this video for sympathy, because I've dealt with those deaths my own way, by doing raps, and, you know, other stuff, I did speeches at all my family's deaths, funerals, just something I've always done. You know, I'm not doing this video for sympathy, but I'm just saying, trying to say, don't take your parents, friends, wife, girlfriend, whatever they are, for granted. Because one day, they could be gone like that. Um, so, yeah. Apart from that, like I said, I'm doing this marathon for me, for personal goals, because I've always wanted to do it, and I'm doing it for Ken, my stepdad. I'll show you a quick picture. That's him there. God bless his soul. Um, yeah, so I'm doing it for Ken, for a very personal reason, my stepdad. I'm going to try and do my best and get, I want to get a math, do it in under three hours. If I can do that in under three hours, I'll be over the moon. If I win, even better, but I'm not aiming to win. Um, obviously, I do go to the gym five times a week. I am going to be starting going six times a week, because I'll be doing an extra day on cardio now. Now, I'm not saying because I go five times a week, this automatically qualifies me to be really good at this marathon. I know it's going to be a struggle, and I know it's going to be hard. But I'm winning to put the training in, and I'm going to put the training in. Like I said, I go five times a week. I do cardio for at least 45 minutes every time I go to the gym anyway. I will do an extra gym day now on just pure cardio to help me get ready for this. Got four months to train because it's on the 14th of October on a Sunday. Going to take me five hours to travel to Cornwall, so I'll probably travel the day before. But um, once I've actually signed up to it and got a page up, because I will be doing a page, um, charity page for cancer research UK, because I've said my I died of cancer. Um, then I will do another video and update you. So and then, if you want to give me any money or support me in any way, it'd be very much. Sorry, excuse me. Appreciated, because obviously I am going to try and raise as much money as I can. I'm going to obviously spread the word. I'm going to tell my gym. I'm going to tell my work. Probably going to tell my local pub. Get it out there. But I'm just saying, you know, for now, if anyone wants to support me and help me on this um, journey, or, you know, even drop some nice comments, that would be nice. Or drop some, give, donate some money to the charity once I've got the page set up. That would be very much appreciated. So I'm going to end the video there because it's getting on 10 minutes. Hope everyone has a good Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to the fathers out there. If you don't have a father, I feel for you. Um, and yeah.
basically just don't take anyone for granted because one day they could be gone and I will keep you updated once I like I said got the page set up and I find out a bit more information but that's the rough information for now is going to be 14th of October a full marathon 26 miles and that's reason and I've said the reasons why I'm doing it so hope you like this video as always please subscribe like comment share definitely please share this video the more support I get and the more donations I get would be helpful thank you and see you later. Inspiration, right? Out.